Here with Vivian, you know her a super lady. We love her so much. She's looking pretty. Mm-hmm. And today, a kuapa chikizi show. Na tunataka kwanza tuambi. As you can see, she's holding a book. Tell me more about it. Yeah, Hi, Vivian. Hi, good? hi. I'm good. Uh-huh. Uh, happy to be here. Uh, so this is my new book. It's called Take Back Your Power. Uh-huh. And I what most people don't know is I'm also a certified therapist. So I do therapy sessions and I help people find themselves. Tell you when I'm confused, when a crisis, yeah. So the book basically gives um, healing tools, yeah, just to help you process difficult things. Um, I think uh, since COVID, the world went through a lot of loss. So loss of staff, loss of even identity, maybe le job will come as well. You no longer have that job, so you don't know who you are anymore. You don't know where to start. Yeah, yeah? it's like today if I stop becoming a musician, so then I would feel a little bit lost. Yeah. yeah. So sometimes, and this is normal. Life in a kuanga ivo unajua. With each stage, you play a certain role. So maybe when you are in your teens, haunga wife kiriya, maybe you'd be here doing the kind of work you're doing now or interviewing people. So na hii season pia itaisha, then you'll go to another season. But most of us, our education system doesn't teach us how to transition from one season to another season to another season. Then we lose friends, we gain new friends, we even lose loved ones. So hizo vitu zote, we don't process. So uko tu unaishingi, ukiwa na stress, unatafta short, unatafta ngwai, unatafta ingi, tuwa nini, vape. <laughs> Unajua, just yeah. to, ku, ku, to numb that thing, eh, mm-hmm. juu, uh, sijui, nini, mnatumianga shangani ya tiyoto wafai kulia, like, you, we are, we are, especially for your generation, like, you're not supposed to feel things, but it's perfectly okay to cry. These things are biological. We have tear ducts. Kazi ya tear ducts ni kutoa machozi. So, in fact, if you don't cry, there's something wrong with you. Lia too, if you have friends who you're comfortable with, who you can cry to, but sometimes everyone is dealing with something. So, also, people have to get the right knowledge. Unona vile kwa tunasoma biology, uko unaambiwati, someone is reading for you. You have to get the knowledge yourself. So, for your own well-being, for your mental well-being, for your emotional well-being, for your spiritual well-being, you have to get the right tools. And this book is a tool that helps Okay, maybe 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 you can tell us why did you decide to call your book "Take Back Your Power"? Uh, I think my whole my whole career and my whole life in the public has been about standing up and speaking up for myself, and it's not been easy. And I I also didn't want to lose my essence. Yeah, so. Internally, I'm a very gentle spirit. That's why my Mbanga songs zaki love, love, kinini, you know. But uneza fanywa mambo mob mbaka hatiako ihaden unajua. So I had to go through a lot of pain to not become, to not harden unajua. To just love and accept people where they are. Ju utalipa producer, toroke na dose, ju kampuni gani, beso nyako, managers, ju ya fanya nini. So vitu za kukukasirisha na za kukufanya who feel like you don't have power ni mob. But I have the power. I have the gift. I have the mindset. I am created for this season of life, for this generation. And not only me, so are you, so are you, and so are you who's watching. Yeah. And how long did it take you to write the book? Maybe in a period to be how much does it cost? So the book is 1500 Kenyan shillings. The link is on my page. Uh, but it's also available at Nuria Bookstore, Eco CBD. It's also going to be available at Textbook Center, uh, probably in the next week or so. Um, it took me about a year to write the book. So I just got my certification in psychology in June. But other than that, uh, my natural essence, even why I'm able to write songs, is I observe a lot. So I observe and then I create. So in an idea, kujua, then I had to learn how to deal with people. Because when you're an artist and when you're a brand, it's like you're a working company. So una deal na marketers, una deal na manager, una deal na stylist, una deal na, you know, so you can lose your mind, eh? So I had to learn proper me- coping mechanisms and to choose the right people. Kuna wengine unaona mmefika mbali but you're not moving anymore unaachilia kirosafi wengine wanakuja. So we have to live life in a way that 
sometimes we have people, sometimes we don't, but we keep progressing, we keep going and we keep growing. Yeah. You posted your daughter and I, you look so young. Like, what were you like? I, who are you in total? My daughter is 13. Yeah, so, I have young jeans. Like, in a chumvi nayo ni me kula. No, she's always been there. I just post her once in a while because she's a child. I want her to enjoy her childhood, to live her life. Already to kienda mahali. Mom, Vivian, teacher, like Staki Akwe in my shadow. She has her own life. But I felt like right now she's grown. She knows how to express herself. And I just felt it was a good time to tell my fans and to tell people. Kuna girl de mapa kasupu kani tu anacha. My dad Juliana and I like a teenager. Yeah, she's a teenager. I like say easy unam handle large. What's your relationship with her? Because of you being on public and I chikuli aje. Ana nifanya tu character development. Juu nikimwambia aoshe vyombo, ananiambia ni mlipe. Mimi nilikuwa nalipwa na nani nikiosha vyombo. Ananiambia you know mom, now I should be reading, but now you're making me wash dishes or whatever. But she's amazing, she's lovely, she's smart, uh, and she has her own path. Whether she chooses to become a musician or whatever she does, I'll just support her and uh, more than anything, more than being Vivian, being a mom for me is a very is a job I take very seriously. Yes. yes. Or maybe uh, to Kimaliza not to party a chance when uh, to Leona, there is a post who posted with Brian Chira. Mm -hmm. You learn something from Chira and also he learned something from you. Yeah. Now a few days ago to make one issues uh Katia Ke na Nyako mm. Chira like Nimtu and Amka Ivy and a two sim to to come my own. But maybe I uh, it's like you guys are close and maybe your friends. Maybe yeah. what can you say about that and also an advice to Chira? Yeah. Uh Shira Kotu Sawa, you know. Unless we will co perfect, mm -hmm. that's when you have the authority to take a stone and cast them to someone else. And I mean, as a therapist, my work is to be pro life. He's a young man, he's only 22. He has his whole life ahead of him. Uh, we even did a TikTok live yesterday, and so many people were there, and we were talking about spirituality and mental health. And I was asking him, now that you have a name, what are your plans? What are you planning on doing? Because, but what are you teaching the world? Because all of us have a role to play in terms of contributing. So I think atuwezi tupana kwa dustbin. We really need to let go of the council culture. I'm not saying I'm immune to anything, but I'm just saying mimi ni kona tools za ku deal na anyone. You know, as a therapist, you cancel murderers, rapists. So, you know, it's not a big issue. Like, let's just learn how to speak to one another. Na mimi, as long as he's willing to have conversations with me, mi sinate mi akumjaj. Unajua, mi have been in the limelight for so many years. Hakuna kitu sitajionea. So, even when I talk to him, sometimes he listen a little bit. But at the end of the day, he's a unique individual. He has his own path. And I truly, fully wish him all the best. Because, sinim toiwa God. Yeah, and his life is valid. So, let's let's just give him a chance. Okay, maybe uh, in this generation yeah. right now, mm -hmm. most of the youths are affected with depression. Yeah. Uh, maybe do you think it's something that has just come up or has been there, uh, uh, causing people to commit even suicide? Mm. Yeah. Maybe do you think it's something that has been there and yeah. uh, say in a julikana too mm. i think it's always been there i think it's always been there it's just that uh, right now of course social media doesn't help then you know social media is very filtered i think even for me and i'm a public figure social media i'm going to come five percent of my life i go to life yaka waida sazingine na nafanya tu vitu zangu I'm just a normal human being, yeah? But young people now, uko na haraka. Unajua, unataka upate hiki tu haraka. Uonekane unafloss haraka. Situi nani hamefanya forex, hakona millions. So pia we unataka ukuwe na hizo millions leo. It doesn't work like that. You have to work, you have to invest, you have to grow, you have to learn. And be very kind to yourself. Be very gentle to yourself. Unajua? It's hard. I really empathize with your generation, by the way. It's hard because it's just hard. But it's a call for you guys to grow up quickly. Yeah. You have to grow up. Because if you don't grow up, yeah.
Okay, lastly, yeah. tukimaliza ya mwisho kabisa. Uh, mm-hmm. You've been in this creative space for quite some time. Now yeah. we maintain sana. Mm-hmm. Tumona Vivian bado ana, ana glow, bado so mm-hmm. ziko sawa. Yeah. And you have an upcoming maybe musician out there anajiuliza. Mm-hmm. Hey, kwani Vivian ni nini umsaidia ku maintain? Mm-hmm. Maybe a uh, word of encouragement to that person. Uh, I think number one, we need to understand that our gifts have a purpose. Yeah. And me, I tell people, me, I love God so much, but I don't need to sing gospel songs to prove to anyone that I love God. Because love exists, people are falling in love every day. We are all products of love making, so I don't know what people are hiding. So that's what my songs are about, and giving people hope. And I think for me, I, I, the way I said on the show, I'm a public figure with a private life. So Mimi, I know I'm on assignment. I know there are things I'm supposed to do and speak life into people, but I also take time for myself. Na class kuingine si post for four days in social media, naenda roundi zangu, naenda soko, na pika ugali yangu, na sikia vizuri. Like I just, I also live. E life ni moja. I'm not going to live for people. I live for myself, but I do what I can to make a difference. Bas. Right. Thank you so much, dear. Uh, 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 yes, I just the bay ya kitabu. Bay ya kitabu ni fifteen hundred Kenya shillings. The link is on my page on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok. Uh, available at Nuria Bookstore, Ikoapo Baza Plaza, Moy Avenue. So you guys can order and get your copy. Yeah, and enjoy the reads. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.